hand to this truly historic demonstration in the city of Toronto. I looked at the group called the Canadian Peace Alliance, and we have organized with partner groups across the country more than 20 demonstrations in Canada on this day in opposition to the brutality against the people of Palestine. And not only is it an historic day here in Toronto, it is an historic day everywhere across the country. Thousands and thousands of people in Montreal, Ottawa, Vancouver, Edmonton, Calgary, Halifax, Windsor, even small towns like places like Kamloops and Lethbridge, Alberta are having hundreds of people lining the streets with Palestinian flags. It is brilliant to see the number of different people who are out at this crowd, and I know people have talked about it before. Jews, Muslims, Christians, Hindus, even old hippie peaceniks like myself who have been out protesting against wars in Iraq and Afghanistan at this very location for more than a decade. But we need more people. We know what Stephen Harper's position is. He does not care about the people of Palestine. He is only concerned about maintaining Canadian imperial interests in the Middle East, which is why he supports the Zionists in Israel. official opposition. There are two opposition parties in this country and all they have said is they had mirrored Stephen Harper's line coming from those leaderships and that is absolutely shameful. We need to be out in our numbers week after week. We all hope that this will end soon. We all know, and I'm sure I'm not any different than anyone else here, we spent our week looking at news feeds, looking at children being killed, looking at the Israelis smugly saying that they have the right to defend themselves. We know that this kind of mobilization brings all of our strength together. We are not alone yelling at the television set. We are here together to say no to the killing of Palestinian people from the river to the sea. Palestine will be free. Stephen Harper and Justin Trudeau and Thomas Mulcair, all of you, without a backbone, without the courage to stand up for the Palestinian people, we say, free Palestine, victory to the Intifada, we need to end the occupation, we need to end the killing of Palestinian people, and we will continue to stand with you, we as long as we need to, to end the brutality. Free, free Palestine! Thank you, brother, sir. Brother, sister, what is unquoted today?